Well, March is Colorectal Cancer Awareness Month, and today you can get a free colorectal testing kit right here at Television Park. People began stopping by bright and early this morning. Volunteers from Doctors Hospital and the American Cancer Society will be here until 1 o'clock this afternoon handing out those kits. Now, Andrea, I make that uh, Lydia Rivera says she saw the announcement on Good Morning Augusta and drove right to the television station. Last week I was actually scheduled for a colonoscopy and financially I couldn't afford the down payment and when I saw this I jumped at the opportunity. And Lydia, we are so happy you did. Now, Dr. Sunil Lal specializes in gastroenterology at Doctors Hospital. He's live in the studio with us today. Doctor, good to have Hi, you. Hi, thank you for having me. I just want to say we appreciate what you all are doing today here at thank Television you very Park. Much. You heard from Lydia, one of the ladies who stopped by to get a screening kit. Now, I know it doesn't take the place of a colonoscopy, but it can certainly sh sh shed some light on whether or not she may have a serious problem. That's right. The uh, fecal, um, the test that we have is one way to do some initial screening to determine if there is blood in the stool, which would be indicative possibly of ongoing um, colon polyps or possible cancer. So at which point, I would assume that the next step, if it comes back as blood in the stool, they would be referred to a doctor, is that right? Is that the way right. it works? That would be, they would be referred to a gastroenterologist who should um, perform a screening colonoscopy, mm -hmm. a complete examination to look at the entire colon and determine if they have polyps which could be removed at the same time that the testing is done. Well, at what point should anyone at least do a screening, the one that you're offering today? Well, the, the test uh, kit can really be done at any age. Um, but colonoscopy screening for an average risk individual with no family members or warning signs or symptoms should be screened at the age of 50. And what kind of warning signs are there that we should be on the lookout for? I think the warning signs and symptoms that we should be aware of are particularly blood in the stool, uh, change in bowel habits, um, abdominal pain, weight loss. So those are some of the the uh, initial warning signs that we should be aware of. Now I know a lot of people think, oh no, a colonoscopy, I don't want to do that. But <laughs> at least if you have any of those uh, warning signs, the screening kits that are being handed out free of charge today here at Television Park could really be a lifesaver. That's right. I mean, they are a form of screening that have a high sensitivity and specificity to determine if there is ongoing blood loss, but at the same time, um, they are used in conjunction with screening colonoscopy testing. So it's kind of an initial step towards that. All right, Dr. Lal, thank you for being here welcome. today. Thank and you for having for us. For all that you do at Doctors Hospital.